Hey guys, I'm Janet on occasion, and today we are once again taking Tarn, Kai, Iolanthus, and Iolanthus into combat. There's some bloom spawn that needs, um... I can't think of any gardening terms. Killed. <laughs> That'll do, right? That's a gardening term. You kill weeds. So yeah, killed. Killed. It's a gardening term. Brilliant. Uh, so anyway, we also need to kill eight enemies with a weapon once again. So let's go. Scans suggest Bloom Spawn have infested these outskirts. That is near a bustling underhive. How can they be so blind to the corruption? Billions go about their pitiful daily lives oblivious to the affairs of their neighbors. Is it so shocking, Knight? Yes. That's why I was shocked. But, you know. Uh, but yeah, cool though. Cool as bits of planets just being uh, torn down. I mean, look at this. Just, just, just horrible Nurgle bloom. Just, just doing horrible things to walls. Leave the walls alone. Anyway, let's get stuck in, shall we? So where, where's the bloom spawns? There's two sides. Okay, there's one over there. And one uh, ooh, outside in the bone pits. <laughs> Alright, cool. Uh, yeah, this is cool, though. This is quite cool. So it's just sort of the outskirts of a factory. Well, and the innards of a factory. Let's see, so I have to go down this uh, this street to get over here. There doesn't appear to be a direct route. Or maybe there is a direct route through here. Just not for a terminator. Oh, it seems to be okay, it seems to be not a direct route for anyone. Uh, alright, let's get stuck in. Alright, I'm running straight in. Let's go nuts. We're not wasting any time today. Bam. Kick down that door. Okay, some enemies there, but we don't have to worry about them. Because we are going to be headed this way. Also, all these statues we can knock over on top of enemies, which is great. I love that. So we don't have to worry about these stairs, actually. Uh, no, I think we'll be okay. They may patrol up this way, though. I'll have to wait and see. I'll have to wait and see where the enemy end up. Seeking the tainted. Yes, please seek the tainted. Okay, Bloom's rising by 20% per turn. So it's not the worst, but it's not exactly great either. Uh, okay, we can't go this way, by the looks of it. If we shoot that, will this blow open the walls and we can we can attack from there, from closer, do you reckon? I think we probably just want to line up by the door, kick through the door. Weapons ready. Well, I certainly know that much. Oh, there's a patrol going that way through that door. Again, that one might end up coming up here. Maybe. Praise the Emperor. Uh, yes, yes, do do that. Taking position. Yes, he 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 likes being praised. At your command. Likes being praised. He's he's keen. He's keen on it. Uh, although arguably he doesn't like being praised at all, and the whole him being a god thing is just. Um, nationalism got out of hand and that he never intended to be worshipped like he is we are hello oh, a lot of enemies and okay yep defend the bloom is triggering two reinforcements left so they can bring in two more reinforcements and okay it's a it's they a scary tree it's a nightmare tree gods watch over me Okay. Hi, everyone. Uh, this lad... This lad... Needs to have his... Um, uh, seed plucked. Uh, we're getting him fixed, okay? We're getting this one fixed. Hello. It's done. Uh, are we going to get the extra AP? No, sadly not. It's a shame. It's a shame. Okay, so how am I going to deal with this stupid tree? I am actually quite tempted to use the teleport now. 
because I doubt we'll be fighting two of these trees. I doubt we'll be fighting two of them, but if we do fight two of them... Oh, there's gonna be these guys as well. Crap. Okay, maybe I want to stay back until they move. So much stuff we can push over or blow up. Maybe these are gonna like run in here and I can blow them up. Or push this on top of them. Or push that on top of them and blow them up. You know, all the things. All the things. Whatever it takes. I am here to serve. Right, let's see. Uh, so our Purgator... I guess I can shoot him? Is that going to affect these guys through the wall? Yeah, I kind of doubt it, right? Okay, I'm going to go here. I am with you. I'm glad. I'm glad. I appreciate the support. It does affect him through the walls because of psychicness. So that's good news. So I can kill a couple of them. Is that worth doing? Or do I want to hit one of these jerks? I can't reach them with that, so I guess I am stuck fighting these jerks. Or what I could do. Uh, oh, that's going to be a crack grenade. And I can't quite get that what I wanted. See, what I could do is put a grenade like here, and it'll knock these two over here, and then he can shoot four of them at once, provided, he yeah, he will survive. I think this might be funny. <laughs> and that's what matters to me. It's always a case of, will this be funny? If the answer is yes, then we're onto something. All right, I'm going to move here. That should get me in range. Uh, oh my god, are you joking with this? Okay, that might get them to where I need them to be. We're going to try. All right, and off it goes. Brilliant. And I might actually be able to attack the plague... If I can attack him, I can probably hit all of them. But I don't think I can hit him. Oh my god, I can. I can hit them all. I can hit them all. That is so fun. I'm playing pool. I'm playing pool with humans. This is so good. I am playing pool with my enemies. I'm literally just knocking them around the table right now to light them up for a trick shot. It's ridiculous. Another one down. All right, that'll, there we go. That'll be five dead. This is, this is not okay. Alright, how, how are we doing on the, uh, kill eight? Uh, with, okay, three left to kill, so yeah, ranged weapons. It's ranged weapons today. Easy. Easy. So if I attack him now, uh, it's only the tree. <laughs> oh, and that guy. There is this guy still. There is still this guy. Uh, who seems a little shy. So I guess I can finish killing him. And he got an AP, that was a crit. Oh my god. Um, now what? I don't want to deal with that. Uh, I could hit him with a crack grenade. You know, that would uh, break two of his armor, which would Praise help us kill him in a hurry. But I feel like just the combined efforts of everyone next turn would probably kill him to bits. So, you know, I could just do that, couldn't I? Yeah, I also want to make sure that I'm spread out enough that he can't kill us all with his mortar thing. His mortar attack doohickey. Uh, so he can move forward still. Actually, I don't want to move forward. Just just get some armor. That'll be fine, thanks. Um, and do you have one AP left? Yeah, this will make this too juicy a target. You're going to move forward. Good. And you... Uh, use your shield. I don't know where this thing's going to land. And... I think I might need to fall back with him. I think I might need to fall back with him a tad. He might be on knocking this stuff over and exploding duty. So, that's fine. That's fine. Okay, let's see how this tree wants to play. Oh, there are other reinforcements coming next turn as well. So I guess he can deal with them potentially. He'll be fine. Now what's the tree gonna do? I know it's odd that we have to be, we have to think, okay, yeah, we're just getting shot by a machine gun, but like, what is the tree gonna do? I'm more concerned about what the tree does to us. You know, trees, famous for being dangerous. Yeah, a lot of reinforcements actually. Yeah, I, I spot them too. We have Bloom again in a second, I think. Uh, I might have to bring our Purgator around the corner to deal with these guys. 
How are we doing on ammo? We have two left. So I could I could hit that guy once and probably finish off the other one. I think that'll leave most of our um, enemies back here, kind of. Um, yeah, that'll do. All right. Oh, this is obscene. Doesn't even seem fair. All right, do you want to finish him off? Good. Perfect. Kablooey. Yeah, he died all right. Uh, okay, there's a guy up here as well. There's going to be more reinforcements, potentially. Um, move done. here. Overwatch. I don't really uh, want to... Oh, 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 ooh, ooh. There we go. Ready to fire. I don't want him to move out of cover, but I'm pretty sure, yeah, I'm pretty sure that's going to cover that area pretty well. Excellent. Now, you guys, uh, so I need to kill him, ideally. You know, in an ideal world, this guy would be dead. But what I can do is actually stand here and I could do the Rend the Unclean. Which would kill him and damage this. Which would probably be a nice way to start this. Although it might also be... Uh, so it has 20 health. It might be nice to hit him with a crack grenade. You know, to hit this with a crack grenade, then move in and do the attack. Um, that might be worthwhile. Yeah, I think that's the way I'm going to play this. So let's do that. Hang on. Okay, so if you move here, I'll, I'll have one. Which allows me to do the, do the move. So actually, I can't really afford to do that, can I? Uh, so you're looking pretty good. You could just start swinging as well. So if I run up to it, I'll be able to attack it twice. So it'll be down to 15 health. If I stand here, I can only do 2 damage per hit. Alright, so yeah, I am best to run up to it and start hacking. It's a bit disappointing. Alright, let's get you over here. Let's get you over here. Let's do your spin move. Rend the unclean. Oh, wow. He went flying. Love that. <laughs> yeah, that's what I was thinking. <laughs> He's so enthusiastic about it. All right, let's, uh, yeah, let's just start chopping. Uh, I can also use four strike, but I mean, that's not really going to do it, is it? No, it's not going to be enough. Although, what else have we got? We still got this guy. He, okay, he has one AP. Yeah, there's no... Yeah, that, whoops. Yeah, there's no doing that. He's... Yeah, we, we'll just have to run up. We're going to get hit by him. We have armor, though, so we'll probably take, like, a damage. So let's just start hacking. Let's start hacking at this tree. Let's start chopping down Audrey 3. That's right, I remember the name of that character. Anyway, uh, right, that'll do, I guess. Somebody might just step in and shoot me, that's fine. Die, die, die. Oh, okay, that's not fine. I really didn't expect them to have cover there. We can shoot back, though. <laughs> nice. Oh, he's out of ammo, though. So that's a little bit concerning, that you could run out of ammunition while doing a reaction shot like that. Yep, that's, that's a vile effluence, all right. Okay. Ooh, ooh, there's the mutation. Yeah, this warp surge. Mutating, folks. Okay, he's now got drained on his weapon. Interesting. So we're going to have to reload. Sure is. Okay, start shooting. Uh, Psychic Onslaught. We'll get the kill, so we'll get the AP back right as well. God, it's just not even fair. It's not even fair. These poor little sods. Uh, okay, let's start hacking. Full strike, do I need to do that? I really don't, do I? No. Not with this many of them. This many knights, that is. Do I want Olianthus to get the kill? I feel like I probably do. I feel like I probably do. Good. And now, oops. Now, Ulric Olianthus. Let's get it. Very nice. Oh, he's so pleased with himself. You know what? I'm happy for him. I'm happy for him. 
Uh, so where's the other? Okay, it's over here, so I could skirt down the side here. So I can actually have these guys just come out this way. I feel like we probably need to kill the remainder of those enemies, though. I don't think I need to use the shield there. That was probably a waste. So yeah, that is... Yeah, that's going to be a problem. We can't, we can't engage. So, I'll run off. Uh, now where are you? 1 AP, huh? Uh, I'll take it. I'll take it. Now you can come over here. Alright, that cultist will have to chase down. That's fine. I just don't want to get that other patrol um, interested in us. So this guy's probably going to shoot us. Ah, uh, one damage. So yeah, we got cover. <laughs> we are shooting back. Unfortunately, he's behind full cover. That didn't seem to matter. What on earth? Wow. Okay. Uh, it's strange. So just a reaction shot destroys the cover they're hidden behind. So that happened up here as well. That's really cool. You know what? I didn't realize that was what it did. So hang on. Uh, none of those things. Where are we? Return fire. It just says you shoot back automatically. That's all it says. It doesn't say anything about destroying cover. But if that's what it does, then that's brilliant. Love that. Uh, I'm not going to psychic consult this guy. I'll just shoot him. Brilliant. And uh, I guess I'll do it again. Right, we've got to really catch up with the rest of our boys now. Uh, oh, good. Good, that's a good start. Yeah, you go catch up. So we've suffered very little damage so far. And I feel like the troops that we've dealt with so far, that was quite a big, quite a big group. The size of the group doesn't even seem to matter anymore. Just the fact that we can, we have so many decent, like, area of effect abilities that allow us to really clean up our enemies now. It's really a big help. Really streamlines things. Okay. Moon rises. It sure does. Alright, you move up first. Okay, good lad. Careful with the swords, Iolanthus. Ew. I just noticed the tree on the bottom right here. Look at this thing. Ugh. There's little eyes rolling around. Eek. Horrible. Horrible. There's a little, uh, little, a little sack. Lovely, little, little... <laughs> I don't know what that is. <laughs> that is awful. Uh, right, I can't quite reach that, unfortunately. Get that in a second, I suppose. Uh, alright, let's move over here. Hopefully that won't wake anyone up. I'm a little concerned now that we're going to see around that corner. No, we're good, we're good. We're, we're good. Moving swiftly. Yeah, well, yes, don't Amanda, don't feel the command. need to rush. Uh, patrol is still loitering. My blade is yours. I'm glad. I'm glad. I uh, I've always wanted a blade. Also, you have a gun, not a blade, you lunatic. Oh, what a loon! Uh, so we do need to get in there. But what I can do, if we can reach this and not trigger. Uh, that bunch. I mean, we're just going to teleport on top of them regardless of what happens, but like... Okay, good. No, we're good. We're good. Okay, so all I really need to do is do anything, honestly. Like, I'm just going to teleport on top of these guys and just blow everything to bits. Um, and we can do that even more effectively now that we've rendered the unclean. So, do you want to smash down the door or go around it? I think smashing down the door is probably a bit more dramatic. Especially because I smash down the door, everyone will turn to face the door, and then we'll be... Then we'll be <laughs> behind them. Oh god, it's a second tree! It is actually another tree! That's That was surprising. I was not expecting a second tree. Oh, some more reinforcements are coming. That's fine. Not a problem to me. Okay, good. Uh, do I even need to teleport? 
<laughs> what do I ever need to do anything? Kill, kill that. What are you talking about? Uh, let's get stuck in here. Although, how much do I want to teleport in here? I really don't know. Because I feel like I'm going to end up getting... Like, there's not a lot of room here. I feel like I might end up getting uh, tripped over myself a bit. End up blocking my own path. Um, but whatever. Let's find out. Hello, everyone. Hi. Oh. If they haven't seen us, we're fine. <laughs> Alright, so first off, have a hand. I, uh, I, I need your... Um, I need to see it. Really? Really? Okay. That... I mean, that's disappointing. Okay. Disabled ranged weapon. Apparently, he keeps his seed in his gun. It is ancient archaeotech. So, I mean, it doesn't have to be in his torso. That was, that was kind of us projecting, I feel. Um, so, I will get attacked if I move. Do I care about that? Maybe not. Maybe not. All we have to do is destroy this thing, and it ends the mission, so... Hmm, how quickly can I destroy this thing? So I am happy to take a bit of damage, if it means attacking this thing. Um, yeah. So that does actually hit that. That will actually hit him. And it'll have, what, 19 health? I mean, I can do 15 damage with just this guy. And I can easily do another 5 with him. But he can also probably kill all the guys behind us. So yeah, this should work. Alright. Spin attack. Love it. I also love that it knocks enemies back as well, because it means he's free to do whatever he likes after that. So, you... Uh, can attack... Can you... Can you only reach him? Uh, I mean, I guess that's probably enough kills. <laughs> Alright, if I need to shoot them twice to get them all, I feel like I should probably move forwards, right? Oh, that's my Justica. Oh, I'm an idiot. This is the guy I want to I want to do the attack. Perfect. Yeah, he's got better range. There we go. We'll attack him. Okay, I can't quite reach this guy. That's a shame. But that's still quite good. <laughs> That's quite good, isn't it? That should probably do it for some, like, experience farming, you know? I think that'll probably, probably cover us. Uh, also, if I attack you, I mean, I'll do some damage to him, but we won't get a kill, will we? Uh, very unlikely to get a kill. Also, if I attack with this guy, I can't get... I can't get, um... I can't get him in. And he can't quite reach, because he's in the way. Well, he'll have to move out the way. Um, somewhere. Alright, you move there. Thanks. And, uh, we're not going to shoot yet. We're not going to shoot yet. Also, this guy should probably move, huh? Do you want to move out the way? Yeah, you move out. Ooh, actually, I could have you... No, it's going to cost two movement. Uh, alright. We're just going to move out the way. Just going to move out the way, and that's fine. Now you... Uh, okay, I have to move there. So, four strike. We have loads of willpower. We may as well just get the extra damage where we can. It might save us an attack somewhere along the line. And, uh, okay, we've another one health. Cool. Now I can kill it with anything I like. So now this guy has two AP, so I can use one to kill him. And I can literally have my apothecary kill the big thing. Uh, when we're ready, that is. So now, if I attack him, I don't think that'll do enough damage for this guy to be able to do the 9 damage to get the kill. So actually, I think it's literally just down to our apothecary to shoot this tree, and we call it a day. So take that tree. Return to the edict for decontamination. I am the wrath of Xyphos! You sure are. Sure are, buddy. It's rare he gets to scream that. He doesn't get as many kills as everyone else. Bless it. But he did kill a big tree. So, for that, for that we have to give him, you know, give him his due. You earned it, buddy.
Hello, everybody. So that's five more requisition and five seeds. This has been very fruitful. All right, let's see what loot we've got. Uh, so the Grey Blade. This seems really good. So it has an auto parry. Crit does extra damage. Higher crit chance. Um, and yeah, and four damage isn't bad. What's this? Unguents of Warding, Tier 1. This knight gains 15 resistance, which increases their chance to prevent a negative affliction. That's not bad, but that's pretty low. I feel like just something that makes them immune to an affliction would be better, right? Now what's this one? Vengeance. So, four damage instead of the usual three. Uh, extra 20% crit. That's quite good. Hang on, the Grey Blade is tier two. This is a tier two thing. I guess the auto parry is alright, but like... I don't know. I guess extra crit damage is quite nice. And... Oh, and four strike actually adds to your crit chance, which is quite nice. So it already has a plus 10% crit chance. You can give it an extra plus 20. And if we can upgrade it at some point, we can give it an additional 20. So if you use four strike, you've got 50% chance to crit, just standard, uh, with this. And you can parry, so it's a good defensive thing. And yeah, four damage is quite good. An extra crit damage. Yeah, that's okay, I guess. Also, what's quite good is the extra crit damage, if we do the move that uh, gives us automatic crits, it means we're doing six damage with this thing. So, okay. It's got some options. It's got some options. We also have uh, Kemul Kajulon. Uh, he's an apothecary. I don't think we need another apothecary. I think we're fine for that. So yeah, I think we're, um, I think we're mostly okay. See, that's a bit iffy. Activate, gain, plus two crit damage to this ranged attack. Like, that doesn't guarantee a crit, so you're really using Cybolt just to, like, do more damage on the off chance you crit. Which I don't think is very good. It does have an extra plus 20 crit, but that still doesn't feel great. It still doesn't feel great. So, Refuge in Faith. This is extra two health, extra two armor. Uh, which is the exact same thing as Terminator armor, generally, the plus two armor. Uh, but it does have more focus, which increases the chances of, uh, of triggering afflictions and autos. So, that's quite fun. So basically that's an extra 10% chance to do something like parry, for instance. And immune to knockback, which is pretty normal. So this this isn't that special, really. It's only focus is the only thing they get. And I guess the plus two health, actually, is, is unique to this armor, which isn't too bad. So maybe I will get this armor. Oh, can I even bother with this grey blade? You know, I'm just going to get the armor and call it a day. I don't think I'm going to take the blade. Okay, we're going to save our requisition a bit. Confirm selection. Yes. And, okay, we've got a couple of three promotions. Wow. Almost four. Iolanthus almost leveled up again. Jeez. That's so good. Also weird that this guy's on rank four, and he needs to get to 650 for his next rank. Iolanthus is rank four as well, and he only has to get to 425. Which is odd. This guy is costing more to level up. Did they scale the amount of experience they need because they knew they'd get more kills? Is that a thing? Let's have a look. It doesn't specify here. Yeah, talents and metics. So the Purgator can equip the side cannon, silencer, and incinerator range weapons. That's it. That's all that a Purgator is. There's no, like, additional stuff. I don't know. So, uh, let's get this support fire. So he will contribute uh, shooting. I think that's a really fun one. Also, Psychic Onslaught doing additional uh, area and damage is pretty huge. Which one's best? I think the extra damage. Because occasionally something gets away with like one health. Although occasionally something gets away with not taking any damage. So let's do the extra area. We'll be able to hit more enemies. Okay, good. That's really fun. Ah, oh, this is so fun. I love this. Uh, also, ignoring cover is kind of huge too. Well, ignoring half cover. Uh, no, we're going to go with the Psychic Onslaught thing, I think. That should do it. We don't have much willpower. I could get some of the willpower bonuses, too. An extra two willpower means we can use Psychic Onslaught twice more. Which I think might be better than just it having a slightly better area. Although, we always get kills, so many kills with it. Willpower is never a problem, so screw it. Let's go with that. 
Now our Justicar. Uh, extra armor. Uh, chance to reload. I mean, he does have a side cannon. It only has two shots, so the extra chance to reload isn't a bad idea. But it wouldn't be a bad idea getting the crit option as well. Um, enraged. Afflicted targets will attempt to melee attack the source of the affliction. Oh, you can provoke. That's fun. That is fun. Uh, force strike. What's this one? Melee. It's just his melee weapon attack. So extra damage. Can armor break. That's very nice. Him being able to armor break with his power attacks is awesome. So we're gonna make our way this way. It's gonna take some time to get down here, but we're gonna we're gonna make our way down there. Okay, confirmed promotion, confirmed, and our apothecary, Aurelian Iolanthus. Uh, what's this one? Iron Arm Biomancy. Target a knight within one range, gain plus one stun with melee attacks for one turn. That's really good. That could stack stuns real quickly. And getting this one so it's plus one stun again is quite good. Surgical Adept. When this knight uses a Biomancy, has a 50% chance to gain plus one AP automatically. That could be quite handy. That could be quite handy, that. Um, yeah. Yeah, these are both handy. Uh, ability gains plus one turn is pretty huge as well, because it means that it's plus one stun for two turns. That's potential for six additional stuns. That's six additional attacks. So yeah, basically we have the power to stun anything. And then execute it and get more AP for having executed something, and then we can attack stuff <laughs> like even more stuff with that extra AP with the additional stuns. So yeah, this stuff could really stack, couldn't it? All these biomancies could really start stacking in a big way. So let's do that. Interesting utility. Um, I don't know how impactful it's going to be, but I think circumstantially that could be really, really good. All right. So passing through a warp storm has a high chance of causing adverse events for the edict. Warp storms also interfere with missions that occur within their boundaries. All right, I'll keep away from them then. I'll just keep away from them. Easy. Obviously, I'm going to go near it. I want to center my ship so I can reach whatever I need to reach. Yeah, off you go. And away you go. Uh, so, we are going to have faster uh, healing for our troops soon. That's really good news. That's really good news. Okay, let's advance time. And ship project complete. Regeneration unit one. Excellent. Commander, the reg the regeneration. The regeneration unit is now back online, allowing Grey Knights with deeply traumatized injuries to make full recoveries in at least 72% of cases. The remaining 28% will no doubt be pleased to continue serving the Emperor in the stasis chamber. <laughs> yeah, I'm sure they'll be pleased. All right. Let's have a look. Additional projects unlocked. Sure are. Um, should go with construction speed. Might be nice to do early. You know, the sooner we do this, the more we can benefit from it. But we only have 21 servitors. So we are actually starting to run a little low on servitors. Extra, an extra 20% ship speed would be pretty great. That would be pretty good too. We could just go in with that more. Uh, meditation chamber gives us the extra experience. And it's only six servitors? That's extra recruit rank again. And only eight servitors, 12 days. Like this is really quick just to max out the barracks. I think I'll do this so we get higher recruit ranks. We need to catch up with our, with our current troops. So let's do that. Marvelous. Uh, Bloomsborn detected. Yep, three new missions. What have you got for us? So there's this one. Uh, growing the bloom. Medium, danger level. Medium, not a problem for us anymore. Uh, win mission without using willpower. That is a really interesting one. Ooh. That's incredibly interesting. Not using any willpower. Uh, I mean, that's a lot of requisition. But that means we can only just, like melee or shoot people. That's it. That's all we could do. That's with Bloom Spawn there. God, this could be brutal. 
Because, like, willpower is how we do every every bit of utility is using willpower. I can see why it's three. I can see why it's three requisition. But I don't think we'll be able to do that. We can just do that mission and not do the, um, you know, the, uh, the glorious deed. It would be incredibly glorious. Without willpower for this one as well. Really. Uh, low danger level, but, like, that's a bunch of wizards and nonsense. What's going on here, huh? So yeah, plague marines, apostate preachers, and cultists of Nurgle. Oh, it's just cultists of Nurgle. That's, he looked more mutant than that, but I guess they can be uh, mutated. But anyway, uh, yeah, that's insane. Winning without willpower. Crazy. Finish the mission before you take 25 damage. Easy. That we can do easily. Low danger level. Destroy the bloom spawn. Grimoire's out of it. I mean, extra research would be good. That would be good. And that's easy requisition. Uh, so if we do that one, it looks like that's still going to have quite a lot of time left. So I think we could probably reach that, thanks to the fact that it's within the, um, you know, the thingamajig. So yeah, I think I think that might be the way to go. So we'll try and do this one afterwards. Uh, I mean, it's low danger level. I reckon we could do this without using willpower. I think that'd be a really interesting one to try. This one, not so much, because it's harder and it's bloom spawn. Although, this is also... No, this is seed carriers. Which means we can't get the auto crits. We can't get the auto crits. Which is dangerous. But anyway, we'll do this one first, and then for this one, we can't get the auto crits for the seeds, but we can still potentially crit. Okay, we still have, like, bonus crit on, um, on, on Iolanthus, so we'll try it. But first we're going to do this mission, uh, where we don't take any damage, and we just, yeah, it'll be a doddle. Let's go. Through the warp storm. Well, I think it's only there, actually. Nope. Warp storm disturbance. Knocked off course. Oh, interesting. Minus one hull integrity. The warp storm has blown us far from our intended destination. Some damage has been suffered in the process. Oh, no. I didn't think it would affect us like this. That's really interesting. So just passing by it on the map will actually impact you. That's really cool to know. But also horrible that we've lost hull integrity. I don't want to explode. That would be bad. So the warp storm has blown us far off our intended destination. Some damage has been suffered. But we seem to have made it. So, yay. So, Jabalath 6. <laughs> of course. Jabalath. Yep. Uh-huh. That's, that's where we're going. Uh, so what can we get here? A Purgator. Another Purgator. Storm Bolter. Falchions. Terminator Armor. Servo Skull. So nothing, nothing great here. Except the Purgator. They're apparently the best bloody units in the world. They're doing great for us so far, but anyway. So this should be easy. By accepting a valid deed, you commit to completing an act of glory in the course of this mission. Success will be rewarded with additional requisition, but the Grand Master will be displeased if you fail. And then he won't give us his precious. So I think we're all set. Just immediately, I, I think we're all set again. Uh, although we are all very high level, so maybe I could swap someone out for someone a little less high level. Like this other... Purgator, that apparently is ready for promotion. Don't know where he came from. Uh, everyone's pretty high rank. Yeah, it's just, it's Vaughn and Hart. Who are like... I mean, Han was with us originally, right? Wasn't he like our original? Yeah, he was our original um, uh, uh, thingamajig. Apothecary. Oh, that no, that's Purgator. Yeah, I'm an idiot. I already swapped him out. Okay, yeah. Uh, let's upgrade his abilities now. Before he complains. Let's go with the return. No, let's go with the range. Go with the range for him, too. Good. Alright, now let's swap you out. Oh, uh, so I don't want to have an injured Apothecary, so I guess we're just going to take the Apothecary that we've been using recently, which is... Yes, thank you. Hi, Olympus. Uh, I I remember. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, yeah, I think that's good. We're just good to go. This has been very straightforward. Yeah, we have all the toys we need. Cool. In that case, guys, uh, you know the drill by now. Comment, like, subscribe. I'll see you in the next one. Take care, guys. Have a good one.